Master Thorne. Yes, 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 yes. Your wife. Excuse me, please, gentlemen. There we are. Gracias. Betty, guess what I found as well. Look, I'm sorry I've been so long. I'll be with you in two shakes. What? Ralph, there she is. What can we get you to? What? What can we? I don't. She won't budge. But what? And our removal men have vanished off the face of the. And hers say she just cancelled them on the spot. So they drove off to another job in Paddington. Paddington? And when I rang the solicitor to tell him, he said if the keys aren't handed over, it's not ours anyway. And everything has gone all insane, right. Ralph. Right. Shh, shh, shh. We have no home. All right, all right. We have got no furniture. Well, yeah. we... Madam, don't upset yourself. Moving house is very upsetting. It's a big upset, man. People get upset. It's according to medical opinion. Who's he? The other removal tribe. No, he isn't. I've already spoken to her men. They're on their way to Paddington. And he's not one of ours. I know No, I... he's moving the Metcalfs into our house. Our old house. <laughs> well, what the hell's it got to do with him? Been in this business 37 years, madam. I've seen it all. <laughs> now, first things first, sir. Uh, your furniture. How late are they? Well, they left Hammersmith with us. Fully loaded an hour ago. An hour and a half over. Yes. Was they stopping off for dinner anywhere? No, they were coming straight here. They had some sandwiches while they were loading. Cheese and tomato. What was the name of the firm? Oh, I've got their leaflet. Yeah, the one's worth now, I think you'll find. have got no name, sir. Hmm? No address, no. No, there's a phone number there. Look. Discontinued. I rang. Cheap removals will move your furniture anywhere, anytime, cheaper than anyone else guaranteed. Ring for free estimate. The operator said there's no such number now. I rang. Yes, but there was, though, when I rang for the estimate and organised the entire... What's it? Probably borrowed a knocking shop, sir. Beg your pardon, me. Um, did you sign official contracts, sir? Not in so many words. He rang to tell them to come and give him an estimate. They did, he said yes, and that was it. Until today. Um, how much was the estimate, sir? Two fifty. Um, what was real firm's quote? Five, six? In between. Well, it's cost you nothing in the end. It's one consolation, isn't it? Apart from all your furniture, that is. Oh, God! Cheap removals, cheaper than anyone else. Everything we own, everything. You strip the whole house. Down to doorknobs. Oh, by the way, sir, that ain't strictly legal. It's everything he does his whole life. We're only moving because he knew we'd get over the odds for our house, and this one's going cheap because our husband's died. I wish mine would! Betty, we're in a strange street. All for 250 lousy pounds. The cocktail cabinet alone costs twice that. Oh, well. Right, well, uh... Look, sir, you go and report the theft. Oh, yes, sir. I'll go and talk to the lady in here. Um, what was her name, by the way? Andreas. Bloody Andreas. Just sitting there. All she says is she's not leaving. Ever. Right. Oh, Betty, there is just one more thing. You didn't take the net curtains down from the basement. Did you? You got two fives for ten. Mrs. Andreas, I presume. Good morning, madam. Madam, moving house is very upsetting. It's a big upsetment. People got upset. Would have no need. I certainly have no need. I no move one 